My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food, and today I'm sharing a quick and easy recipe for no-bake oatmeal scotchies. You just need a few simple ingredients. You're going to need some vanilla, some oats, milk, sugar, butterscotch chips, and butter. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is add my sugar, my butter, and my milk to a large saucepan and I am going to let this come to a boil. Once it starts to boil, I'm gonna let it boil for one minute. So my mixture's been boiling for about one minute. Now I'm going to remove it from the heat and show you next steps. And now I'm just going to add in my butterscotch chips and I'm gonna add in a pinch of salt and you don't have to add in salt if you don't want, but I'm adding just a little bit of salt in. And I'm just adding in a dash of vanilla. And I am going to give this a good stir. The butterscotch chips aren't going to melt completely, and that's okay. But you're just gonna stir this for a couple of minutes. And now I'm going to fold in my oatmeal. And this is quick cooking oatmeal. I'm just gonna fold that in. Okay, I've got my oats all combined and now it's time to scoop them out. You can use wax paper, or you can use parchment paper, and you're just gonna place pretty big spoonfuls or scoopfuls out. You can press them down if you'd like. And you're just gonna let these sit for about 15 minutes until they harden up. Okay, so here are the no-bake cookies. They were completely set up after about 20 minutes. My husband and I really like these cookies. It's a nice twist from the chocolate and peanut butter version that they have. I will tell you that the original recipe calls for two cups of sugar. I felt like that was way too much. I only added one cup of sugar and we weren't missing that extra sugar at all. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed to our channel, we'd certainly love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.